October 25th, 2013 was the day my favorite story began. Our story. When I turned the corner in the basement of the Land Nakai house, I would have never dreamt that in that very moment, my life would have been changed forever. And the Lord God said, it is not good that man should be alone. I will make him a helper comparable to him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall on Adam, and he took one of his ribs and closed up the flesh in its place. Then the rib which the Lord God had taken from man, he made into a woman. Therefore, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and they shall become one flesh. Green and I always had one major thing in common, our love for horses, practice during the week, rodeos on the weekend, and even summers out of state. We fought, laughed, and cried together. She's been there for my accomplishments, and I've been there for hers. This is the occasion for Isaac and Karina. This is an important time. This is a special time. This is a beautiful time, a joyful time. <laughs> Thank you. Are you going to cry? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Never did we think Karina would find anyone to spend her life with that was up to her standards to deal with her sassiness, or most importantly, find someone that was taller than her. The day we met Ike, we knew she had found him. I instantly knew there was something about you that I just could not quite get enough of. One question I will never forget from that night was, are you a Christian and have you accepted Jesus Christ into your heart? What a bold question to ask somebody that you barely knew. My heart instantly filled with joy. At that very moment, I knew I was falling hard for you, but also fell in love with the people who raised you to be the God-fearing man that I prayed for my whole life. We did not meet by chance or because of fate. We fell in love because it was God's will for us long before we were brought into this world. And I will praise him tonight as his will is being fulfilled. To the person who will be rocking in the chair next to me on my front porch 50 years from today, I can still remember when I was young, praying for God to help me find a girl who loved to fish, loved to cook, and loved God. Well, he answered my prayer, word for word, and then some. I can vividly remember thinking, after one of our hour-long plus long-distance phone calls, that she is the one for me. Shortly after, I remember gathering up all my courage and tried to slip in a quick, I love you, before we hung up. To my surprise and horror, she heard it. She paused for what seemed about five minutes and then set it back, and the rest is history. I promise to always admit when I'm wrong, but to let you know when you are too. <laughs> I will continue to be your biggest cheerleader, critic, and accountability partner. I will support you, honor you, and love you unconditionally. I am proud of the man that you are and all that you have accomplished. You are my person, and I will continue to choose you every single day for all of my days until death do us part. Uh, you are the love of my life, and I vow to protect you, care for you, encourage you, support you, and clean up the stalls for us in my heart. You are my person. I love you. Isaac, you may kiss your bride. Oh boy. It's my pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Isaac Leon. May y'all have love, health, and wealth, and most importantly, may y'all have time to enjoy them all. Isaac and Karina, your hard work and perseverance is very admirable. The amount of work you have done on your property alone is a testament to that. 
Let's raise a glass to Isaac and Karina. Congratulations. Cheers.